So Virgil Ortiz comes back after his 17-month layoff and gets the stoppage in the first round against Frederick Lawson. A lot of people believe there was an early stoppage. It should have never happened. Tony Weeks waved it off. Um, Virgil looked pretty sharp. Still got his power. Um, this really shows me nothing because, like I said, this is... I, mean, I understand this is a comeback fight for him since he's been sick, moving up to a new division. He's been off for a while. I get it. But, I mean, if, if it would have went a little longer, then it would have shown me a little bit more. But, I mean, he got the first round stoppage. Like, I had called it for, like, the third third or fourth round. But he stopped it earlier. So it's, a, it's a lighter dude, man. He moved him up in weight. He was supposed to do that. So, I'm not really impressed by anything. He did what he was supposed to do. He still looked like Virgil of the... You know, the older Virgil, well, the welterweight Virgil. Um, but, I mean, the the quality of competition, I mean, who was the guy? You know, so he did what he had to do. He Good body shots. He, one of the body shots hurt him, like I figured was going to happen. And then he you know, knocked him out, knocked him to the ropes. Virgil just went there for the kill, went to finish him off. And then Tony Week jumped in and waved off the fight. A lot of people believe it was too early. And uh, Lawson probably could have recovered. I mean, but he was on the rope. He was on the ropes, shelled up. Man. He wasn't really throwing no punches back. So, you know, in theory, bro, that wasn't really a, a, a early stoppage. He wasn't. He wasn't showing Tony Weeks nothing. He wasn't even trying to get out of the way. He just backed up on the ropes and, and sat there. He didn't try to move. He couldn't throw no punches back. So, I mean, he was. He was getting beat up, man. He was getting beat on. So, I mean, was Tony Weeks wrong? I, I doubt it, man. But nonetheless. Virgil got the win. Welcome to 154. Who's next for Virgil? We'll have to find out. But we'll know what y'all thought about this fight. This was literally like a sparring match for Virgil. I mean, dude, only, I think he threw a few jabs, man. One little right hand that barely hit him. That's it, bro. This was like an easy paycheck for Virgil Ortiz. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, let me know what you think. Drop a comment. I will catch you later on the next one. This is Rebel Life Boxing. Love y'all. Catch y'all later.